We're back. Activision Blizzard's up nearly 11 percent in the past three months. And bullish options traders think there's more room to go. John and Pete have that unusual activity. Tell us, trader. There's that stock today, guys. Yep. Take a look at this one, Scott. This one's me. This stock was a little bit lower, actually, earlier today. It was trading around 52.30 when we suddenly saw all kinds of buying. October 11th expiring, so a week and a half out buying of calls. And they bought some big size. They bought 15,000 when this initially hit of these October 55 calls. So pretty aggressive push. They've got a little bit of time in front of them. Not a lot, but a little bit of time in front of them for these to produce. I like when we see something like this. This is a name that's we've seen this nice move, very, very rapid move to the upside. They also enjoyed a pretty nice September, and we were talking about that with the financials. But take a look at that. Is this ready to break out to the upside? It sure looks like it, and somebody's betting on that. I got a second one as well. We talk about Freeport all the time. FCX. Well, today we're seeing Freeport McMoran once again. Now, what does this play upon? So you take a look at this chart. It's had these little bit of recoveries, had a little bit of recovery there, but it's almost right back down to where it was before. Is this thing going to get ever get back up into the 10s and the 11s? Once again, somebody is out there. They're rolling from October to December on the 11 strike calls, buying 5,000 of those. They're only 22 cents, a very inexpensive shot. Basically, you probably got to read into this. Is this a trade deal type of thing? October 10th, we know that date. You go out to December 15th as well. We've got all kinds of dates out there talking about the trade. Is this one of these stocks that could react? Absolutely. I bought these calls. I already had calls. I added to them today. Okay. Doc? Two quick ones, Scott. Uh, first one, Stephanie Link added some uh, DR Horton, I think she said today. This one plays into that Masco. Why? Because, of course, these guys make kitchen cabinets and a whole host of other stuff. And Masco shares up 85 cents, about 2% on a day when the market's down over 200 points. They came in, we're buying a October 44 calls. Love that, I bought these, and I'll probably be in them two to three weeks. Second one quickly, take a look at uh, PCG. This one, of course, the big utility one that's been in the news for all kinds of bad reasons. Maybe it'll be in for some good reasons again. Take a look at that, Scott, back in June when the stock was up here at 24. That might be making another move, I don't need it to go all the way to 24, though, because they were buying the 11 calls in October. So only a little over a buck out of the money. Love that. I put a lot on this one. I'll probably be in it two to three weeks as well. Hey, guys, quickly, and I should have done this when we, we had this okay. initial conversation, sure. this, this Schwab news. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, no fees, stocks, and ETFs. Options, though, still 65 cents a contract. What's your, what's your take? We got news coming for you on that soon, Scott. Um, <laughs> love to be seriously. able to tell you now. <laughs> yeah, I'd love to tell you now, but uh, you'll have to wait for the press release. Yes, but sir. yes, uh, people will be addressing that, and uh, I think this is a real opportunity going forward. It's the growth area of the market, Scott, the options world. We talk about it all the time. We're averaging almost 21 million contracts per day right now in terms of option contracts. Think about that when you contrast that with what's going on at the NYSE and other places where you're seeing volumes go lower. This is going higher. This is a record year we're on right now. Oh, okay. I'll look for the press release. Don't let me find out that information somewhere <laughs> No, we'll else. tell I'll you. Tell you that right <laughs> now. Exclusive with Scott <laughs> right. Wapner.